Greetings and salutations, viewers. To Zai Cybertronics coming to you with a new Transformer review. And as you can see, it's on. He's actually my first masterpiece figure, Masterpiece Grimlock, the Hasbro edition. Now, I didn't have the money to spring for the Takara issue, um, but through some uh, deals, I was able to get a hold of the Masterpiece Grimlock from Hasbro. Uh, as you can see, here he is in his in Grimlock and dinosaur mode. It's wonderful. As you can see, this nice translucent plastic on the neck to reveal all the gears and that. Just really phenomenal. Uh, get a nice 360 of this. I mean, just look at the beauty and the detail in this figure. I mean, molding, uh, paint is just phenomenal. I mean, the molding of the back here is just fantastic. Um, I really love this nice, huge Autobot symbol here in the middle of his chest. Um, in dinosaur mode, he has some interesting gimmicks. First of all, these arms here are on ball joints at the shoulder here which is really nice, really nice articulation. And the fingers of the T-Rex mode are articulated. Now, unlike Hasbro, they're not metal, so don't have to worry about them cutting you. Another nice little gimmick here is if you open up his mouth, A, you see right in there, you can see the flamethrower attachment. Plus, this spot here on his mouth, if you push it, you get a nice biting action. Uh, the teeth are kind of dulled down because he is the Hasbro edition. The other nice little gimmick here at the T-Rex head, if you flip this open, you see these little spots here. You can rotate his eyes from blue to red, back to blue, which I keep mine in blue. Show colors. Show accurate colors. Which is fantastic. The other gimmick here is at the tail. And if you move the tail, his head will rotate. And also here at the tail, it is articulated. So, that is wonderful. Really nice detailed to have with the Masterpiece Grimlock. Ooh, background. <laughs> the backdrop fell. Now, I'm not going to show transformation on screen. It's A, it's rather complicated, and B, I don't want to break him. Because he is fragile. So, I'm going to do a cut. And then we're going to go into the dino mode. And I'm going to steal a little thing from Arlecon. So, and swipe. And here we have Masterpiece Grimlock in robot mode fantastic robot move. I mean, he's increased the size from when he was in dinosaur mode. Which is phenomenal. And it's very G1-esque. G1-esque. This is G1 look <laughs> of the Grimlock. More different transformations than the original Grimlock, which is alright with me. Um, more into the molding. You have really nice molding of panels and that, and a really nice Autobot symbol right here in his chest. One of the gimmick in robot mode. I have his eyes displayed as blue. There's a little switch in the back of the head. You pull it up, and you get red eyes. But I like mine blue, so I leave Grimlock's eyes blue. Um, this arm here does contain the light. It's We'll turn it on. You should be able to see it. So, and it goes with the following his blaster. Right here. Or the sword. I prefer to keep the sword in hand. So when he can't really see it with my little lighting here. Um, each of the weapons do come with an additional peg, which is right here. 
and there's a spot here on the other hand that will peg in so he can hold the other weapon that he doesn't have a grip on in the light hand so that he can hold it and he also comes with the <coughs> crown of leadership which fits on his head really nicely like so and then you have King Grimlock now I really do like this figure and to give you a really idea how big he is pan down a little bit <laughs> that's the world's smallest Grimlock compared to Masterpiece Grimlock so Masterpiece Grimlock is rather tall so it's really nice detailing is phenomenal you have the head can turn 180 on both sides can't be 360 due to all the back kibble and that but overall a really phenomenal toy I recommend you getting it if you can get the Takara edition get the Takara get the Hasbro get the Hasbro now I'm actually looking for the the Takara extras that came with Grimlock if I can find them, I'm going to get them, and I'll do a review with them. If not, I'm sticking with this, because it's Grimlock in all his beautiful glory. So, Masterpiece Grimlock is full naked bacon. Go out and get him. He's worth it.